Hello everybody, my name is Robert Nakshu and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how to add shadow in Photoshop. There are multiple ways to add the shadow in Photoshop. There is the beginner way, the intermediate way and the advanced way. I will show you the beginner way, the simplest way to add shadow in Photoshop. It's easy, quick, let's get started. Ja. So, this is my object and this is the wall that I want to cast shadow on it. To make uh, the shadow for this object, I will select the layer with the object, double click on it and I will select the drop shadow and I want to make it uh, very realistic uh, with the minimum of effort so I will uh, show you how to do that. First I will go here where is this uh, black color, click and I want to pick a color that's behind the object like this blue and I want to make it a little darker like this. I want to have uh, some colors but uh, also black in it and uh, hit OK. Now change the blending mode from normal to multiply. Now I want to reposition the shadow maybe a little down and uh, on the right. To do that you can uh, do it uh, manually from uh, here where you select the angle and the distance or a little trick and um, a shortcut for changing the direction of the shadow is to just click on the shadow and move it around. Okay? And I want it like this. Now, I want uh, the spread uh, a little small and the size. Here you can play with uh, the distance, the angle, the spread and the size. You need to combine them to create the ideal scenario for the shadow. It depends on uh, the lightning and your preferences. Where uh, when you when you're done with uh, customizing the shadow, uh, another trick is to reduce the opacity, like this, about eight eighteen percent, to make it. Uh, uh, blend in uh, very very good and that's how you add the shadow you can also change uh, the shadow uh, after you cast it and hit back ok so those are the basics on how to cast a shadow on an object let's recap you double click on the object, it will pop up the layer style, you hit drop shadow, customize it, uh, change the blending mode to multiply, uh, change uh, the color with, with uh, something that's from the background and make it a little darker, hit ok, uh, play with uh, the spread and size to customize the shadow and reduce opacity that will make the shadow very realistic with the minimum of effort. I hope this tutorial was very helpful for you. Let me know what you want to learn next in the comment section. And don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel for more awesome videos. Robert Nakshu, Jap!